The narrative tells about a guy who abandoned his devoted dog, and what happened next will undoubtedly bring you to tears. Welcome to Amazing Truth Channel. Do not forget to subscribe and activate the bell button to receive all new. Now go to the story. Dogs are among the most fascinating and adorable animals on the planet because of their reputation for devotion, intelligence, and emotional depth. For this reason, having a dog is an amazing experience. Sadly, Rex's life was completely flipped upside down when his owner abandoned him on a desolate street and vanished from sight. But what really stands out are the things that happen next, things that can reach the furthest reaches of your heart. From the time he was a little puppy, barely old enough to take care of himself, Rex had been with his owner. He had been meticulously educated by his owner to eat, drink, and relieve himself. Additionally, he had gone with Rex for his very first stroll in the park where the Golden Retriever puppy had happily run about, playing with other dogs, sniffing the new grass, and making new friends. Rex's owner used to constantly bring toys and goodies for him as he matured, and they enjoyed playing in the garden before collapsing on the sofa to watch TV and go to sleep. Rex didn't give it much consideration as his owner ushered him inside the vehicle. He assumed they were simply heading out on another exciting excursion, perhaps to a field or park, or even to meet some new people. That sounds like a lot of fun. Rex enjoyed the ride for several hours, taking in all the sights and scents as he joyfully watched the world go past the window. When they finally came to a quiet little neighborhood, Rex's owner leaned across to put a leash around his neck. Rex moved to lick his face, excited about getting out of the car and going for a walk, but he was shoved back violently. Though he didn't give it much attention, he found it odd Rex was able to leap out of the car as his owner got out and went to the passenger side. Rex's owner grabbed his leash and led him a few meters to a streetlight pole set into the ground. After that, he tied the leash to the pole, securing Rex to that location and preventing him from moving. The owner then got up, silently made his way back to his car, got in, and drove off. Not even giving Rex a sidelong glance, Rex was perplexed. Did they play this game at home as they used to? Would his owner return after getting anything, like a toy or some food? Rex's tail kept bouncing with enthusiasm and anticipation, even though he wasn't sure. However, a minute grew to ten, went to an hour, then to two, then to three, and still Rex stayed there by himself, bound to the pole. He began to come to a depressing and somber understanding, and his tail gradually stopped wagging, it was possible that he wouldn't see his owner ever again. Maybe someone had left him behind Rex quietly whined to himself and looked around. Only the occasional person passed by and didn't give the dog a second glance. Similarly, several cars had driven up and down the street but paid no attention to the dog tied to the pole. Being alone didn't suit Rex at all. He was a friendly and sociable dog and loved to be around people, but it started to dawn on the poor dog that maybe people didn't like to be around him. He laid on the ground, sad and dejected, but he noticed a young woman approaching him out of the corner of his eye. Undoubtedly, even though she was in her late teens and enjoying her music, she also undoubtedly observed the dog affixed to the pole in front of her. The girl gave Rex a quick glance as she went by, but she continued to walk, taking care to stay out of the way of the possibly hazardous animal. Rex groaned a little and went back to sleep, certain that he would never, ever find love. But the girl stopped abruptly. She removed her headphones, carefully turned back to face the dog, and took another look at him. She reached out a nervous hand and began to softly touch his head. She put her hand on Rex's head and began massaging all over his body. For the first time since his owner had left, Rex's tail began to wag once. The girl realized the dog wasn't a threat, she searched the area for unfortunate Rex's owner, but there was nobody in sight. She even waited about an hour in hopes that someone would come get the lovely puppy, but nobody did. It was almost nightfall, and she felt she needed to aid Rex in some way. She attempted to loosen his leash, but the knot was just too tight for her to manage. She had nothing at all with which to chop or clip it. Quickly thinking, she reached for her phone and dialed her closest buddy. She'd be aware of what to do. She informed her of their location and asked her to bring certain things to aid poor Rex. The youngster snapped pictures of the situation to provide the authorities with proof as they waited for her buddy to arrive. That kind of canine abandonment was cruel and disgusting, 
and she would be sure to file a report and send in her photographs as proof. If Rex's owner was lost, at least the authorities would know that such atrocities were occurring to helpless animals. The girl's buddy showed up in her automobile in 10 minutes. She hurried up to the scene and showered Rex with affection. His tail was a flurry as it waved back and forth, clearly enjoying the attention. Rex's companion had packed a huge can of food and drink, a water dish, and a blanket to keep him warm. Rex snuggled in happily and savored the cool, revitalizing water before watching the girl attempt to untangle the knot while perched on his new blanket. Rex was relieved to be free of the pole as it finally started to come away after several arduous minutes. The first female judged that he was in need of a quick stroll. Rex must have wanted to stretch his legs a little, even though she had no clue how long he had been chained to the pole. She was accurate. As they strolled up and down the street, Rex gladly took her with him. However, night was falling, so they went back to the car to decide what to do next. The two pals didn't know what to do at that point. Do they bring him back to his house? Do they let him go and roam about freely? Do they make a call to a shelter and allow them to come get him? After a quick look into Rex's bright eyes, the solution was obvious. He was clearly a devoted dog with a lot to offer and love to give. He was willing to bring love into someone's life, and all he asked for in return was love. The young lady grinned. She would go home with the puppy and keep him all to herself. She had always wanted a pet, but had never made the effort to obtain one. She assumed she would know when the moment was appropriate, since she was constantly so concerned about not being a good owner. It appeared that fate had intervened and brought her into contact with Rex. This was the indication she had been waiting for, been trying to find. She bowed down to give the panting, happy puppy her whole attention and promised to love and care out for him for as long as he needed her. She would not desert him as his previous owner had. She would never do him any harm, nor make him feel unworthy or unwanted. The stunning golden retriever would receive daily attention from the girl and be given the life he so well deserved. After she brought him home, they enjoyed a peaceful, contented life together for the remainder of Rex's years. What thoughts do you have on this inspiring story? How would you have reacted if you had come across a dog similar to Rex, abandoned on the side of the road? Would you have given the poor creature a somewhere to stay, or would you have just ignored it? For more motivational stories, don't forget to follow us and give us a thumbs up in the comments box below. We would appreciate hearing your thoughts and opinions. I'm grateful. If you like the story, surely the next video that's appearing on your screen will move you too. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, give us a thumbs up, and activate the notification bell so you won't miss any of our next videos. A huge kiss, and see you in the next story.